it to House. Got seven to shoot to go back to McGrady. And he's hacked. One way or another, McGrady's going to be involved. Yeah, this time a nice post up on Westbrook. Westbrook 6'3. T Mac 6'8. Left side of your screen. There it is. There's the foul. So. Previously the 20-footer by McGrady, now looking for two from 15 feet away. And McGrady misses. Looks trying to make it a three-possession game with this free throw with a minute five to go. Team Max still looking rest, rested. McGrady second, no, missed it. So six-point game with a minute four to go. And one of the better three-point shooters in Durant. So the Knicks adding some drama as we go down the stretch. Knicks had made their free throws up to that point, 15 of 17, but two misses here. Only, oh, uh, anything could happen here. There's plenty of games to go, 30 for most teams. So Harden will inbound. Minute four to go, they get it to Green, who fires a three and hit it! Oh, what a shot! <laughs> No hesitation by Green, but that was... McGrady's going to inbound along the baseline, so got to be careful here that Oklahoma City didn't get a run out. They go to Chandler, who misses the dunk. I thought he was fouled. It did look like there was contact. Yeah, Green looked like he was fouling him because he got duped. Westbrook trying to beat House. Goes in, lays it up over to Lee, and it's a one-point game. And the Knicks... Do not have to take a shot. They can run it right down to 20, or right down to They've one. got a foul, man. There's no way they can let him run it down. They've got a foul. They haven't fouled yet. It's a bad move by Oklahoma. And now he finally gets eight. fouled with 12.8 left. <laughs> and he did beat the buzzer, so now House goes to the line. Two free throws. He's, tell you what, Clyde, the Knicks end up winning this game. It may have a new garden hero here. Yeah, two of them, T-Mac and House. Uh, House has been in eight different NBA cities, and including have, Phoenix for Mike D'Antoni a few years back. You have to wonder why, Mike, the way this guy competes and how he plays and how valuable he can be to a club, why he's been traded so many times. And he's got them both, three-point lead. Eddie House got 19 and ice water in his veins. Well, they'll inbound on the front court across from the next bench. Gallinari's guarding Durant. I think Durant's going to inbound the ball. He is. So you got to be careful. But that doesn't mean he can't get it back. Right. They're going to go back to him. That's a favorite play. A lot of teams like that. So 12.8 left. Let's see. They get it to Westbrook. Westbrook now outside the arc. Backing off. Gets to Durant. He's off the screen. He fires. And he hit it. Six seconds left. So many times the Knicks have it to give, and they don't utilize it. They get in trouble. They should be switching. They should be switching on this play. Watch this. They don't switch. That's how he got open. You should be switching. It's the last. Come on, man. He's going down the stretch of the game. Watch it. They do not switch. And that's why the screen worked to free him up. David Lee did not read it until it was too late because Kevin Durant with a ball in his hands from 25 feet can be deadly. Right, you got to guard the arc. Why? Because the two point it will do them no good. So they're not going for the two, they have to go for the three. So now plenty of time for the Knicks. McGrady, Lee, Gallinari, and House. And this crowd, 19,000 plus on their feet. Yeah, they still believe in their heroes. They think they can prevail. And Knicks have a timeout left. They're not going to use it. Lee kicks over to Gallinari. Fires at the buzzer. No good. And we're going to overtime. Let's see what happens. Well, Lee, Lee wastes the line. You know Lee would not be trying to go one-on-one. -on -one. So Gallo was the obvious guy to go for. Westbrook does a good job denying him as we go into OT.